Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having an amazing day. If you are new here, make sure to hit that big red subscribe button down below. And if you do enjoy this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to move the iMovie green screen. If you do not know how to add a green screen in iMovie, I'd highly recommend you watch my video where I show how to do that. It will be linked in the description box down below. The apps you will be needing are iMovie and Pocket Video. Both of these apps are completely free to you. So without any further ado, let's get into the video. So what you're going to do is go to Chrome and search up green screen backgrounds. Then you're going to find a green screen that is pure green and then save it to your camera roll. Then go to iMovie and click the plus button, then hit movie. Then select your green screen background and once your movie is created you're gonna click on the green screen and then select Ken Burns disabled. This will make the green screen not move. Then change how long you want your green screen to last. And after you've done that, export the movie to your camera roll. I'm choosing high definition quality. So once you have done that, go to pocket video and start a new project. Then click YouTube vlog. Afterwards, you should click on the plus button at the bottom and then select the button that says camera roll. And then click find your video and select it. Then click on the button that says video sticker and then add and then click on YouTube. You should see a search bar pop up and search subscribe green screen. Scroll through the options and select which one you'd like. Once you've selected your option, the video should pop up. Then what you're going to do is trim the video so that only your green screen is there and that's what I'm doing here once you have done that click on the button in the top right corner that says done then your green screen video should import and a red box should form around the video you can also change the size of the green screen and you can move it wherever you would like. So you're going to want to place the subscribe button green screen in the place where you're going to put the green screen in iMovie. For instance, in this video I want to place the subscribe button on the bottom of the video so I'm simply going to put the subscribe button at the bottom of the green screen. After you've done that, you're going to click on the finish button in the top right corner then you're going to save the video to your camera roll. After that has been done, go to iMovie and find your project where, that you want to add the green screen and just add your green screen. Like I've already mentioned that if you don't know how to add a green screen to iMovie, check out the description box for a video on how to do that. So now I'm just going to trim the video and I'll show you how it looks. And now I'm going to show you a comparison of how it would have been if we didn't move the green screen. So as you can tell, in the moved one, the subscribe button is at the bottom of the screen, not in the way of the lyrics. And the original one, the subscribe button is right on top of the lyrics. It may seem useless to have to do all of this to have your subscribe button at the bottom of the green screen, but if you con constantly need your green screen or subscribe button to be in a certain spot, if you just do it once, you can easily put it in the spot that you want. So that was it for the video. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe and like. Bye!